talk about the fight later. Dre, you guys, two questions. Yeah, Dre, yeah, Dre. Dre, 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 what would you rate uh, Shakur Stevens' performance? Come in, come on. 10 out of 10. Is he ready for is he ready for the guys like Tank, Valdez, Warrington? He's he ready for everybody. But I'm gonna continue to sound like a broken record. I think I think macro, not micro. I'm thinking long term. So if I can get another, if it's just solely up to me and I can get another two fights, I'm gonna give him take that. Because it's not gonna hurt. But he is the type the type of fighter and he does have the kind of talent where you gotta challenge him. He does better as the competition is better. So um, if we got the title shot tomorrow, I'm ready. The team is ready. Josh, Jay, top rank, Antonio Leonard, we're ready to rock and roll, but I'm never opposed to getting another fight or maybe two more fights. As, as far as uh, the reports, Kovala turning down a fight with Canelo and Listen, the money. I, I try not to speak on other people's money, but if the money that is being reported behind the scenes, I'm not going to say what that is. If that's true, you better take that money and run because he's not going to get that money at the light heavyweight division and he's going to fight he's going to be fighting tough fights at that at that weight class. I don't know what he's getting if the yard fight goes through in Russia, but you take that money, bro, and, and you run with it. And uh that's generational type of money. So I'm not the manager or the promoter. Though, so. We see it next week next week the rematch against Alvarez. How much do you think he has left in the roster? He's got a good amount left. Yeah, I'm about he's got, he's got a lot left in the tank. Now that I don't know if that's a year, two years. Two fights, four fights, I don't know. You gotta watch the fight by fight. When you get his age, and you've been in the kind of fights he's been in, and he has as many fights as he had, you gotta watch him fight by fight. But he still gotta, based on his last fight, he looked good. Yep. So, hey, hey, um, fight week's coming up, uh, Pacquiao Thurman prediction. Echo. I mean, that's a tough one to call, man. I go back and forth. You know, one day I, I can see Thurman, you know, maybe decisioning Pacquiao, maybe, maybe even catching him, maybe. Um, and the next day I, I can see Pacquiao doing the same thing. That's a pick em fight for me. Don't have a clear cut winner. Uh, Thurman's been off. He didn't look hot in his last fight. So maybe he got some rust off and he'll look better in this fight. Um, Pacquiao looked, looked good in his last fight against Broner. I don't know if that was more Broner and, and, and more Pacquiao. I'm trying to see. So, um, I don't have a prediction on that fight, man. I, I'm, I'm, that's a 50-50 fight. I want to see what Pacquiao has left, and I want to see what Keith Thurman shows up. Guys, let's